this window display is one way of marking the day that's in it. But across White Friars Street here in Dublin, in the Carmelite Church, they have a slightly different way of marking the feast day of the patron saint of young people and of love. The relics of St. Valentine are thought to lie in this casket, and people come to seek his intercession. Among them, a group of fifth-class pupils from St. Catherine's School in Cabra. The superpowers today would know trying to get an army is not always the easiest thing. The custom in Rome was that once a man got married, he stayed at home for the first year to establish the home, start a family, therefore couldn't be sent to battle. So Claudius outlawed marriage. But Valentine, the priest, said, that's wrong. The emperor thought that the unmarried people would, would make better soldiers than the married ones. And what did Valentine think of that? He didn't want it because he wanted to and he married in secret. And the emperor didn't like him marrying people in secret, did he? No, that's why he got his head, that's why he was put to death. Every minute does um, a thousand euros spent on war, a million, a million, a million euro million spent on um, wars and arms and bombs and all. And like, that's, life is more <coughs> important than that. The money could have went to refugees in the, um, in Africa because they have no houses and um, they just wasted it. Which is stronger, war or love? Love. 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 We wouldn't be here if like, there was no such thing as love now. A ceremony blessing people's engagement and wedding rings was also held at the church today. Joe Little, RTE News, Whitefriar Street, Dublin.